Hello everybody, I am Exploding Apple, and welcome back to Song of the Deep. So I did figure out where that other piece went to, but like the only way I, I'd be able to get past it is by um, just getting through this little thing again. And the piece should be right here. Just grab it, and just, just travel back. And I think it would unlock this door right here. Oh, crap, where did that go? That's not where I wanted. No, come back. Grab it, no, it despawned. Damn it, okay. Sorry about that, that was very unintentional. Gotta do this again. Just grab it. All right. Okay, uh, oh, okay. I'm just not used to these controls just yet. Okay. Um, right here is where I drop it, right? Drop it nicely. And it should lead to this door right here. What's this? Boost jet. Is this a device capable of boosting... Amidst the wreckage of an old Fomori vessel lay an undamaged propulsion device. Hold A to use boost Marin jet. Marin bolted it onto the back of her submarine eager to test out its effects on her lightweight craft. Okay, well there's obviously a lot of enemies right here. There's a lot of them. Um, what to do? Maybe I'll just keep farming for now or something like that, because that's what they'll do a lot in games. And I'm losing health, like, fast. So, like, I'm going to try not to do that. So if I pick this up, that doesn't really do anything. Okay. Oh, this is what the boost thing is for. Oh, that's so, that's so cool. This is the trade thing. Do I have enough? Concussion. Oh, okay. So these are like the upgrade stuff. Concussion claw. Increase the claw's damage by modifying it to strike with a concussion claw. Using the Purchase upgrade. Yes. From the hermit crab, Marin took out her tools and made a quick modification to her magnetic claw. Okay, so I guess my objective here is to use just explore as much of the map as I can, and then like. Maybe if you explore everything, maybe you beat the game? I don't know, but that's my theory. That's not what I wanted to pick up. The thing I wanted to pick up is over here. Throw an object while holding down the boost to perform a super throw. Okay, that was not a super throw at all. Holding objects while using the boost. Oh, but this current is way too powerful. If I can just... Now, this is not working at all. How do I do this? I'm trying to go as fast as I can, but the current is way too strong for me. Maybe I have to, like, throw it downwards so the thing can land. Like that. Oh, I get it now. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm really stupid. Like that. That's how you're supposed to do it. That took me a few tries. Probably I had to cut the, some of that out. Mero Ruins. looked in awe all around her. She knew this place from her father's songs. These were the lost ruins of the Merrows. <laughs> Ooh, some coins over here. It's here. It's just a walnut, I think. I don't think it's a walnut, but it looked like a walnut. Save point. Lantern jellies blocked Marin's path. Although the creatures could be deadly to the touch, they were very shy and even avoided each other's light. Okay, so I guess I can't go that way. I apparently. Where else can I go? Oh, 
Okay, that, that's a cannon. I'm supposed to avoid that. Can I attack it, though? No, I cannot. The cannons are invincible, and I just died. And shuddered, as if oh, but I get a checkpoint. Dream. For a moment, she thought she had experienced her own death. But it had merely been the time showing her one of the many possible roads ahead. Okay, so I guess whenever I die, there's a checkpoint. I guess. Alright, so... Obviously, I'm not supposed to go near that. Because I was really stupid and just went for it anyway. Or I can use this to destroy it? Possibly? Will this work? Oh crap, I just threw it away. That did not work at all. Can another one come back? Oh, okay. So apparently, like, throwing things at him. I want to try and kill this thing, actually. Okay, well, apparently it doesn't die. Okay, well, that's good to know. I just, w I, then I just completely wasted my time. Oh, whoa, you guys came out of nowhere. Where'd you guys think you were coming from? Doesn't look like I can go through here either. No, I cannot. I cannot get that. That sucks. Can I use the bombs? No, that, 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 that's, it's not going to go in time. What's up here? I didn't explore here yet. Marin peered through the windows of the houses, wondering if a Mero girl once lived there, and if her father had sung her lullabies about the world above. I guess I can't go down there yet. I think. I doubt that I could use the bombs to blow it up. So I guess I'm going a different way. Okay, these are... Oh, better not touch those. Okay. These are traps. Do they go in a pattern? Yes, they do. And they're coming closer to me. Searchlights. Shine twin beams of light in front of a ship to eliminate darkness and interact with sea life. So I can have those jellyfish move. Machine. Can, let's she see if this works. The front of the oh, it does work! They would help guide her on her journey. Okay. So apparently touching them... Okay, so that works. Okay, that, that's... Then that's actually really good to know. I can actually get past that. But uh, the important thing is not to touch them. Of color darted through the shadows. Was that a Mero Maiden swimming through the ruins? What was that? I didn't, I didn't know what that was. Something's down here. Aha! That means I can get to the coins! Yes, thank you very much. And there's some coins down here. Great. And there's a little gap right there, but I can't go through it. That's good to know. Alright, so I guess that means, uh... Wait, is this a secret right here? No, it's not. It's just another gap. This is, though. I don't exactly know what's in here. Uh, I don't think that was anything. That was also very good to know. Alright. Do not get hit by that. Definitely not. Merrin tried to speak to her, but the Mero raced away. So I guess I'm supposed to follow that mermaid or something like that? I guess I am. So I'm going to try and do that. Oh, okay. Don't run into them. It's okay. Okay, do, do not run into me, please. I am having a light here. Don't make me use it. I have a flashlight. Okay, another another coins. Where else can I go? 
Oh god, more enemies. Okay, so apparently they take a few hits to die. That's that's okay. There. Take that. So, where to go from here? That's my question. Is there something in here? I didn't see what was in here. Alright, killed them. What are these clams for? I actually do not know what they're for. They just open up and they just close. And that's it. More money, thank you. Okay, I can't break these things. How do I do that? Maybe throw another rock at them? I don't know what to do. Okay, I guess I can't go that way either. Oh, this is the way I came from. Nothing in there. So where should I go beyond this point? A glowing swirl in the water tugged at Merrin's sob. Was this a tiny vortex? Where might it lead? What is this? Warp. Marrow ruins. Okay, so I guess these are worlds? I don't know what that is. The Marrow Maiden stopped. Merrin called to her. Please wait. I'm only trying to find my father. The Marrow looked at her for a long moment, then stirred the water with her hands, forming a ghostly image. Was the sunken ship graveyard known as Skeleton Reef? Could her father be trapped there? The Mero pointed the way to go, and Merrin thanked her. Before she turned to go, Merrin asked the Mero her name. Call me Kara, she said. Another girl once called me that years ago. She said it means friend. Oh, that's sweet. Um, so I guess that was the first level time, or what else is there to explore? I don't know. There's just one time vortex, okay. So I guess that means there's gonna be multiple worlds, I'm assuming. Hi, mermaid thing, what's up? Okay, you're not gonna talk? I can't talk, okay, fine. Uh, what is here? Nothing, okay. So I guess I'm supposed to go down into wherever that thing was tell telling me to go. Another trade crab. What should I use? Oh, I, I do not have enough money for any of this yet. Okay, well, sorry, I don't have anything to offer. Okay, that's a dead end. Treasure chest? What's in here? What is this? Hull fragment. Each hull fragment increases your maximum health. Okay, so I get more health. ...of a Fomori Sentinel's hull. She hammered it into the wall of her own submarine, making it more resistant to damage. Oh, I saw a fish. What's over here? I cannot grab that. But I can grab this, though. Did I go over here yet? I don't think I have. Oh, 
I know what that's okay, so you're supposed to grab onto these. Okay. Uh, yes, scrap it. Okay. Alright, so I can use that as useful things. If I can okay, yes. There we go. What else is there? Ooh, there's a little tunnel thing up here. Apparently, my thing was supposed to go this way because this was the goal, but I got completely lost. So, like, I went completely the wrong way. Quilled pufferfish was not a direct threat, but it steadfastly refused to move out of the way. Can I throw this at it? Nope. Okay, well, then I give up. So where to go next? I'm supposed to go down there, I think. Oh, I think I know. Oh, I'm so smart. So what is in this gate? To reach the lost graveyard of ships, Merrin would have to cross the foul and treacherous region known as Watcher's Hollow. This was a place her father had never sung about for the tales of the Watcher were known only to those below. Okay, so I'm going to have to end it right here. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching this, and um, I'll see you guys in the next episode.